You've got kick-ass products and what you're selling has a high demand in the market. Yet, why aren't people buying from you? Having a great product or service to sell is an important part of your business. Although important, it's not all that determines your success. Your product has to be marketed and sold to the right people at the right time. And customers these days pay more attention to marketing messages that are personalized and relatable. They buy from you if they feel you understand them and you connect to them. Hence, your marketing efforts and messaging style should be highly focused and personalized so that your customers think that you've read their mind. But do you think, knowing the general demographics of your target audience, like where they live, how old they are, what their interests are, will help you connect with them better? Of course it will, but you need one more thing on top of it. Your target audience is not a group of people who can be grouped together by general demographics. You cannot just say 18 to 27 year old males are my target. It's too generic and vague. Think about this. The same person on a Monday morning and a Friday evening will have two different state of minds, moods and intentions. So it's important for you to be as specific as possible with your message. You should exactly know whom you're talking to, when you're talking to them and how you're conveying what you wish to convey. Creating a buyer persona will help you do exactly this. A buyer persona is a detailed but a fictional representation of your ideal customer. The persona will have a name, demographic details, interests, behavioral patterns and everything else that a normal human being would have. This will allow you to better understand the needs, wants and pain points of your customers. If your marketing efforts appeal to your persona, it will appeal to your customers. So this begs the question, how to create a buyer persona and what to consider while creating one. The first step is for you to like this video and drop a comment on what you'd like me to talk about in my upcoming videos. That was smooth, wasn't it? Let me know in the comments. A buyer persona can be created in five simple steps. The first step is to research your audience or existing customers thoroughly. Who would buy from you? What their personal life is like? If it's a business, who's the decision maker when it comes to making a sale? Who will contact you from their company? Collect all the demographic details that you can. Segment your buyer persona based on the similarities and challenges. Group your audiences into different buyer personas based on their job title, industry, etc. Create the persona. Give a name and a story to their persona. How old are they? Where do they live? What are their hobbies? How many kids do they have? Give all the details to your persona that a real human being would have. Define their desires, needs and challenges. Define their goals and desires that aligns with your product. What motivates them? What problem are they trying to solve? And what's the hindrance to their success? Use this persona to develop your sales and marketing strategies. If you're able to empathize and connect to your persona using your strategies, you can connect to your customers as well. Use these five steps and create your persona. And let me know what you name your persona in the comments below.